to the condo um, and see it. So I'm going to kind of go a little buck wild, uh, make sure I'm safe in a, in a little static egg um, and heal up, you know, heal up. But, you know, if you guys, if you guys watch my videos, like I'll sit, like this morning, I'm going to, uh, the, the video I put out before, um, somebody really almost caused a wreck. It was scary. Um, but I just stayed calm and I was like, okay, I'm going to get this on tape. He like honked at me. He had his brights on. He flipped me off. Um, it was scary because he was swerving all around. I mean, just swerving all around. I was just driving normal. Um, and it was pretty scary. Um, people are getting aggressive about this because of the situation. Um, I'm not going to lie about that. Um, and I'm, I'm not, what they're trying to do is make me look like an egotistical jerk. Like, oh, this has affected me. You know, that, that shooter doing this has affected me. It's, it's uh, you know, now they're on me. So that they really are pumping it up for a psychological effect um, because they know I make videos and they know I'm going to talk about it. So they're really pumping it up. So I'll be like, oh, well, this all has to do with me. Um, and that's not what I'm saying. Um, I'm not saying it selfishly. This, this kind of violent action, um, it makes it bad for everybody. It makes it bad for the other side. You get really aggressive people who work for DHS, um, who do who do really really aggressive things, um, you know, because they're angry and they want, you know, they're they're looking for they're looking for a target, um, and we are target individuals. So you know, be smart, play cool, guys. Like I know that sound. I know I know how that sounds. Um, I know I sound corny. I am corny. Uh, I, I I really think that. It was beautiful uh, what this girl did. She went around on the videos and she was like, you know, it's going to be all right. Uh, we're going to get through this. That kind of encouragement um, is really great. And and she's right. You know, she's right. And, I, you know, I'm not trying to freak freak anybody out. Um, just trying to get evidence um, and really play it cool. But this is really a dangerous program. Um, they're trying to cause danger. Um, they're trying to cause wrecks. Uh, you know, they're poisoning people putting poison it smells like sewage in my car um, I don't have any food in here that's rotten so you know I, I just I notice a lot of people um, in the condo um, kind of doing weird stuff um, and I know I know the people above me um, do have weapons they're making the you know the rooms uh, that I sleep in are just filled with that high pitch sound and because they're hitting me with ELF, they're hitting me with a low frequency around my spine and my head. My dog is just like, her eyes are so dilated and she just lays there um, because, because she's a dog, so, so she hears that ELF. Um, it's hitting me in the head. I don't hear it, uh, but it's hitting my, you know, it's hitting my muscles and the bone, you know, in my head um, and it's causing a lot of pain. There's a sheriff right there with a lot of tenant windows and stuff. Um, I hope I'm getting that. Um, I, I guess I'll do a 30 minute video right here. I, I just, you know, really remain calm. Um, that's, that's a really important thing to do. Uh, we haven't done anything. Um, these people are the aggressors and that, that's a honk. They're starting to honk at me uh, when they come by. Um, they're starting to get really, really aggressive. But as long as you stay calm, you know they're hurting your body they're hurting your mind um, but there's will you got your will you know calm down get your spiritual center know that you haven't done anything um, and then and then just kind of act normal around people people who are doing this don't try and and mess around with them um, you know just if they're doing something weird just be like you know come on um, and people will kind of uh, They'll respond to that um, because these people think they're all cool and they're trying to, you know, stalk us and get reactions. If you don't give them the right reaction, um, it'll neutralize it. So it's it's all about neutralizing the stuff, not giving it the reaction that, that it wants. Um, this program, uh, the reaction that Cosmo and I, I can't remember his name. Uh, I think it's Gavin. The reaction that he had was what they want. Um, it's what they feed on. Um, you know, it's, it's what they can build these fusion centers off of because nobody has the knowledge of the directed energy weapon program. Uh, nobody has the knowledge of the electromagnetic frequencies that they're torturing us with or the remote neural monitoring. People push that aside or they, or they admit it 
that we believe that, and there's a black SUV with one light. They admit that we believe that, and there's a stop light on me. Let's see how, how short it is. Um, but they, they, they believe that we believe that. These DHS fusion centers, and you see, everybody's honking. Y'all hear it? Y'all hear this? This is what happens, okay? I have it on tape here. I am, I am saying to all TIs, peace is the answer in this complicated situation. Because you got a bunch of firecrackers going off. You got a bunch of people, they're looking for somebody to target. Um, so if you neutralize it, if you play it cool and you didn't do anything and you just, you're just like, okay, whatever. Um, don't give them the reaction they want. It neutralizes it. It creates peace. And then we just work on it in a different way. Work on it in a different angle. You know, the conference calls, uh, you know, like, uh, I, you know, I'm going to get a lot more active peacefully. Um, you know, I'm going to do that million TI march in Washington. I'm going to take the archetype of Martin Luther King. I know it sounds too big. But this is huge. I mean, these, this is a city of people with one light swarming around me and honking uh, because, like, they look at their phone and I'm a target near them. I mean, this is like, if you think of us as ants, these are a bunch of ants crowding around one ant with technology. Um, it's, it's crazy. Um, so I'm, I want to do that big thing, uh, that symbol, that archetype, um, you know, I, it's not going to be just me because I can't do I can't do it alone. Uh, a bunch of TIs. I really want to do that. I want to get the wheels turning on that. Um, you know, it's it. This is this is a this is a um, a complicated battle, um, and we've got to fight. Um, we do have to fight. Like I want to tell you all that. I'm not, you know, I'm not saying hey, don't do anything. Um, you know, fight the right way. Um, there was a comic book I read once. Um, with, with this comic book character named Gladiator, something clung on to him. And it was like a mold, right? Um, something clung on to his chest. And he kept fighting it because Gladiator is like, he's one of the most powerful superheroes in the Marvel Universe. Um, but, but this thing that was on his chest used uh, that aggression. Uh, it used that power to grow and to grip more on him. Uh, like Kind of like tar or mold. Um, and it was, a, it was a short little, you know, short comic. And at the end of it, yeah, uh, my, my V2K is like, one of the ladies is like, kill him. You know, kill him. Uh, he's done. Um, but the mold, and there's a share. Look, there's a three, three of them. Three right there. Three sheriff. Montgomery County, I don't, I've never even heard of Montgomery County. Uh, there's three sheriffs right there in a row. It's really heavy. Um, I'm a non-violent person, uh, telling people not to do violence and to be peaceful, but because I'm a TI, this has affected my targeting and every TI in the city's targeting. I'm, I'm going to talk to the other TI. I haven't talked to him yet because uh, I think he's busy. He's busy with work and stuff, but I'm going to talk to him and see how his targeting is going because of this. Um, so at the end of that comic book, what Gladiator does is he lets go. He lets go. Because it's a complicated battle. Um, the mold uses his aggression. Uh, it uses his uh, his want to fight. That's why this is complicated. Because they'll use your aggression. They'll use your anger. So at the end of the comic book, he lets go. And the mold uh, lessens. It gets small and it falls off. Uh, because it doesn't have any strength to grow. Um, so, so I want you to, to think of that as a metaphor. Uh, because this is a complicated battle. And aggressive reactions, any aggressive reactions or anger, uh, will be used. Um, so to play it cool and to play it smart, and we plan and we strategize uh, for peaceful action with the police, getting them aware, get, getting everybody on the same page, because people are on different pages. The DA, a lot of people who work for DHS fusion centers, they don't know about the directed energy program. So these people are slamming me with microwave energy. And I'm driving out here and these people are confronting me just thinking I'm crazy or whatever lies these people have told them. I'm innocent. Uh, the worst crime I've ever done is smoke weed, uh, which I'm not doing now. I'm not doing it now. Um, but, you know, I just want to tell you guys, uh, use that metaphor of that comic book of Gladiator. Um, this is a complicated battle and they use aggression 
uh, they're gonna so you've got to calm down and you got to play it cool you see people you know get evidence get evidence and be like oh man that's what a jerk you know what a jerk that's crazy don't get amped up um, don't get um, you know don't get riled up or anything like that um, is what I'm saying so this is a supplement to the video I made earlier um, I'm kind of tippy toeing through the subject it's a very serious subject guys um, and I know that when I make these videos um, I just want to be transparent to y'all um, I, I, I'm kind of tippy toeing around it because it's a very very sensitive subject there's a one one running light uh, white car I mean I've got people uh, with brights like following me and stuff it's um you know they're acting like they're spies or something and it's a lot of people in the city um, so so this action against me the DHS fusion centers and this this action it spurs me to uh, to gather with other TIs which which we've all done like we've all done we gather with other TIs and we strategize we strategize peaceful solutions to getting everybody on the same page so these people know we want to make these DHS fusion center guys know the first responders EMS workers we're being hit with directed energy weapons. This isn't some kind of one-to-one uh, -one where it's where it's some person of interest that is dangerous, and you know they're just going around free. These people are hurting us, and then we're being confronted by these DHS fusion center workers. Um, so, so it's a complicated battle. We've got to build awareness for these people so that they calm down. Uh, we want to neutralize everything, and it works. Like I mean, I today my head and my neck, I it is just. It's crazy pain. Um, you know, right now I'm doing okay because I'm in the car, but the guy above me is just nailing me. I mean, he's just nailing my head. Uh, he switched from the high-pitched noise, so they're not doing the high-pitched noise anymore, just the straight ELF, uh, the, the low frequency, just hitting all around my neck and my head. I think the remote people uh, keep saying, you ready? Um, and then they'll hit me in the, in the sides of the head, and I think this guy will hit me in the spine. I think... I think maybe I have about two remote uh, remote stations. I call them remote stations. Brian too calls them um, remote. Uh, anyway, the station that they work at to remotely hit you with over the horizon radar um, and delivery mechanisms for this electromagnetic uh, frequency, this directed energy. Um, I think I have two, maybe three, um, and I'm sure those are very expensive. Uh, they really want to shut me up. Um, you know, I, I just, I guess, I guess the, the way that I am, um, I'm going to do this. Like, I'm going to tell the truth about it. I haven't done anything wrong. Um, this is, it's, it's really big. It, it's really, they're, they're saying that they're fighting domestic terrorism and threats, but they really are the domestic terrorism threat. Um, it's that complicated. Um, it's that complicated. People are turned around. It's a 180 black is white you know you know like uh, Kevin Costner says in JFK in the JFK movie you know up is down black is white um, you know it's 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 a more complicated situation than like hey let's take on these people uh, if we neutralize this use your will to neutralize it um, and it's more successful uh, people people respond to that these people who are doing this without knowledge of what's happening um, if you just stay calm and you, and you give them normal human reactions, um, and then we work on it from other angles. We work on it from awareness. Don't confront these people. Um, it, it, it's, it doesn't work out. That's what they want. Uh, so, so my main point in this is that what, that's what they want. Uh, what that guy did, this directed energy weapon program wants that. Uh, it feeds off of that. Uh, those cops didn't want it. You know, those co the, the cops in our community don't want that kind of thing. Uh, but they're unaware of all the angles of this, the compartmentalization of the Directed Energy Weapon Program. And these people really, they want to shut me up because even though they're hitting me, um, they're hitting me in the head, and I know, I know sometimes I sound, I kind of drawl on. I notice that on the, on the video. Um, it's kind of, it's hurting my, my spine. Uh, it's hurting my head, so I'm kind of drawling on. And I understand that, but I'm going to keep going. Um, you know, I'm going to try and, and get under something, uh, you know, get under my, my new enclosure in phase three, my new enclosure. Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to kind of build it up. I have to to protect myself. Um, my, my electronic defenses are working, but they're really using a lot of power on this stuff. 
Um, you know, they're really turning it up. 